So the craziest thing happened to Joe Lee and I this last weekend. We went to see legitimately probably the world's greatest pumpkin carver, Master, Master Pumpkin Carver Barry Brown to show us some tips and tricks. And one of the reasons that I filmed this, the reason that I pretty much film anything is because I'm looking for some kind of hook that is also a Christian, a spiritual metaphor that I can use on this YouTube channel. We get to where he's presenting we sit down I pull out my camera I start filming and I was absolutely blown away by his presentation like his presentation could not have been any more perfect for this Christian YouTube channel come along with Joe Lee and I to see a portion of that presentation and see his metaphor for the light inside of a carved pumpkin. Also, make sure you watch to the very end of the video to see a special presentation of an exhibit by Barry Brown. Let's go. This was needed quality and quantity time for Joe Lee and I. We had just had a long weekend with others and it was nice to just be together. So to the topic at hand, if you're a Christian, you're the light of this world. You're to not only number one, let your light shine for humanity, but to number two, let humanity know that light shining in your heart comes from your understanding of Jesus Christ. In the past, I've missed out on that second part. For years now, I've made a conscious effort to attempt to be a bright light, to have infectious positive energy for the people around me. But in retrospect, I've clearly fallen short relaying the source of that energy, the light of this world, Jesus Christ. In a conversation with a Christian couple, we were deliberating over this idea, relaying the source of our energy to humanity. She stated that in the middle of the night while stopping for gas, she felt led by the spirit to pay for the gas of another lady parked at the pumps. With credit card in hand, she walked up and explained the gesture, and this lady, through sobs, relayed she couldn't pay for much gas. More on that in a moment. Carved pumpkins are such a great metaphor for our unique spiritual gifts. When they're carved out, they're unique, but the light is what magnifies that gift for all to see. Back to the gas station. After the good deed, my friend walked away searching for a way to explain she was led by the Spirit, but couldn't find the words. Maybe you can relate to this. I know I can. In the same conversation, her husband told a work story of finding himself on an elevator with someone who was clearly lost in the building. He offered directions, but also led this lost soul to the right floor and location he needed to go. The thought that this man should glorify God because of this deed came to my friend's mind. The man thanked him for his kindness and without hesitation or thought, my friend simply asked, how can I pray for you today? Now this was an amazing lesson for me, to solicit requests for prayer, whether it feels comfortable or not, so others can know the source of my light my energy and desire to do good deeds. So we finally got to see our master pumpkin carver. And you know that analogy, that metaphor about the carved pumpkins bringing light into the darkness? Yeah, that was his. And throughout his presentation, he dropped several little thoughts about Christianity that were palatable for a secular audience and explained pumpkins shine light in the darkness. And that's why he does what he does. And here's what I challenge you to do. Do the same thing. 
Let your light shine so that others may glorify your Father in heaven and consider gently revealing the source of your light to them because you have asked them, you have solicited a prayer request from them. I've already said a prayer that God would bless your endeavor, that others would glorify Him when they see your light shining in the darkness. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Boy, that sounds good. That little light of yours, I love to see it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Yeah. So, my little punkies, that's the story of pumpkin carving. The light shining in the darkness. Okay? All right. Have a great day, everybody. Shine your light.